Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials up 116, Nasdaq up 36, S&P's up 15. We'll go over we'll and take a look at these uh, S&P's first. What you're going to see out here, folks, is that, yes, you got to a higher high, couldn't hold price, and hard to comprehend, but we are going to have another contraction of volume. Uh, S&P, uh, the SPY, got up to 294.21. Uh, bottom line got into the lows of the last high up here, which was generated uh, last uh, mo uh, Monday, rather. Uh, well, right now, we've done 41 million shares. Yesterday, it did 65. You know, we'll see what it can do, 65. Uh, bottom line, your benchmark out here uh, today is, uh, well, we're already at it. We're already closed. Uh, you got into the low of the high, which is 292.77. Uh, uh, no, or 292.89. So 292.77 is the number. 290. Yeah, 292.77. We're 292.89. NDX 100 did the exact same thing. Uh, bottom line, NDX, uh, three Qs got up to a price point today of uh, 189.43. And right now you are at 188.32. The number to keep your eye on there is going to be 187.91. Gold, gold contract out here. We take a look at gold. Gold is trading at a price point of 14.99. And you have done 392,000 contracts. What that actually is doing that's actually pushing up to the high. Didn't hold price, but you're pushing up into the top of the range. You do have volume behind the move. Basically a decent setup coming into Friday. It's going to be really intriguing. Why? Because of good old King Dollar, folks. King Dollar. We take a look at King Dollar. What you have with King Dollar is this. Uh, King Dollar right now, uh, basically down 400 ticks. We're in the lower, well, we're in a lower range, not the lower range. The lower range starts at 98,371. When I say the lower range, that means that it could actually get down to 95. Right now, it is inside 98,932. You do get some price spread on the baby. Uh, we'll see if it ends up uh, staying down at those lower levels. Uh, each and every time that the dollar basically has got to highs, hasn't been able to basically get higher, meaning volume dies in the vine. Each time we'll pull back, volume also is dying in the vine. So we've had a long sideways movement. Stay right there, folks. Next 60 minutes, trade and come back. And I do expect this volatility is going to continue. Uh, market's having a hard time holding price, period. It has been having a hard time holding price for quite some time. Dow. Dow up 118. NASDAQ up 38. S&P's up 16. We'll come right back.